And good Wednesday evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Nick Toma. I'm Candace Kelly. Elected officials in Tobyhanna Township are getting some heat from volunteer firefighters over a drafted fire ordinance giving them much more control over the fire company. Tobyhanna Township supervisors gave Tobyhanna Township Volunteer Fire Company the chance to provide their input ahead of the public hearing. And WBRE WIOU, Eyewitness News I team reporter Caroline Forbeck sat in on the fire company's meeting. She's live now at the Topahami Township Fire Station. Caroline? Nick, Candace, here's what it all boils down to. Tobyhanna Township Volunteer Fire Company is a private corporation, but this proposed ordinance gives the township a lot of control, near total control over the fire department. Tobyhanna Township Volunteer Fire Company held a meeting Wednesday night to discuss the 13-page fire ordinance proposed by the township supervisors. It's 10 pages longer than the current ordinance, which has been in place for several years, and it would allow the township to wield a lot of control over the fire company. The firefighters are not necessarily on board with that dynamic. Fire Company President Ed Tutrone explained that they're a 501c3 nonprofit and not legally affiliated with the township. It's not just taxpayer money. We do fundraising. Um, all these trucks that you see in here, there's probably five or six million dollars worth of just trucks. That's not the equipment on them. That was not only paid with taxpayer money, it was also paid with donations. It was also paid. Kuba Township gives us money. The proposed ordinance states if the Board of Supervisors believes the fire company is not performing effectively, supervisors have the power to appoint their own fire board. Their fire board would have total authority over the fire company. This is a guilty till you prove yourself innocent. Type of yeah. document. It also states that the Board of Supervisors has to approve elected fire chiefs and assistant chiefs. And it gives the Board of Supervisors control over all fire company expenditures. And the equipment and trucks the fire company purchased would now be owned by the township. Them having control of this fire company because they believe we're delinquent. Um, another one is going to be the, the equipment that they tell us what we can or can't buy. With, if we want to go to the bank and take a loan out and buy something, and we have the credit to do that, we're going to do it. Tutrone says the fire company hasn't had any issues in its 92 years of service, and he doesn't know why the township is pushing for this. The township does have the authority to do this under the existing ordinance. We have reached out to the township manager. I'm told the township will release a public statement soon to communicate the township's explanation of the proposed ordinance. You can read the drafted ordinance for yourself on our website, pahomepage.com. Nick, Candace, Caroline, thank you.